Hello guys, it's Liu Tudi. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make metallic chrome text effect in Affinity Photo. To start, go to File, New, choose a template. I like to go for 92A x1080. You can make your own custom too. I like to start with a black background, so, so go to new, I mean to layer, and new fill layer, choose black. Then for text, press T, press down, I like to go for the demons font, I'm going to put down in the description, 300 size, and go for gray color, so write down 128. On RGB. Then write your, down your text. I'm going to write my username. Uh, then I like to center it. You can have it anywhere you want. Then you go to effects or layer effects. Make sure you have an inner and link the chain. 100 that's max um actually you can have you don't have to need to unlink it actually so um, make sure it's above 100 choose a profile i like to go for the fourth one you can pick and choose and you can make it custom but the fourth one is good to me uh, for the direction, I would like to go for the 80 40. Uh, the shades, so I go for 50 and 50 for the other highlights and shadow. Then, when you are happy with it, close it, group the text just in case. So, just press Ctrl G. And rename your folder. I like to write the text so I know it's text. Open a new layer or make a new layer. Then go for the, press G for gradient tool. Make sure you don't have the the bucket tool. And uh, press Shift and uh, make a shape or gradient. Uh, Maybe around here. Then you go from normal to overlay. Then you go to adjustment, gradient map. Whatever color you have, make sure on the left side have white. Actually black, I mean, sorry. Then white on the right side. In the middle you can have a any color, but uh, I'm going for blue. When you are happy with your color, just exit out. Go back to your pixel layer or the gradient layer where you made that layer, I guess. Go to adjustment, curves. I'm just going to add some points, so I'm going for five new points, so make it like curvy or like a wave. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, this one is I can just remove. Then you can adjust it to your liking. So. You can add more or less if you like it. When you're done, just exit out. And you've kind of basically done, but we'll have to finish some small details. You can see it's there is like rough edges. And it kind of look wrong when it's white, I guess. To fix that, go to your text. Press Ctrl J and you're duplicated. 
drag the deprecated one to the top um and that wasn't top here is the top then go to layer effects make fill opacity to zero go to outline make it two for the radius and from outside go to center then you have a nice finished touch this is how I make my metallic chrome text effect.